Reba Water District is already on the road to being dissolved. The governmental agency that regulates water districts has already started that process. But today, word that the district's general manager is under investigation and suspended. There are roughly 1,600 homes served by the Sativa Water District, but how they're served and what they're served is hard to swallow. Brown, smelly water often comes out of the taps in these parts of Compton and Willowbrook. Actually, sometimes it comes out black. Um, and it has like rocks and some type of weird like smell to it. Now an attorney for Sativa confirms the water district's general manager, Maria Garza, has been suspended reportedly for paying people to show up at a town hall meeting and pretend to support the district. Today, U.S. Representative Nanette Berrigan writes, we will not be distracted by these alleged tactics and our communities will continue to demand clean water, transparency and accountability. This water is actually disgusting. It's just it's just bad. Like everything's bad. Like why do we have this type of water? Why can't we have clean water? County health officials have tested the water and say it is safe to drink. That the discoloration comes from manganese, a byproduct of old pipes. But a petition is underway to recall the five members of the Sativa Water District Board. And homeowners here are taking part in a class action lawsuit seeking reparations. This all comes after government officials began moving last week to dissolve the water district and are expected to vote on that next month. LA COUNTY OFFICIALS SAY SATIVA HAS HAD YEARS TO FIX THIS PROBLEM AND IT'S TIME TO MOVE ON. SOMETHING IS AWRY AND IT'S TIME FOR THAT TO BE OVER. NOW ELECTED OFFICIALS SAY THERE'S NO QUICK FIX TO THIS PROBLEM. GETTING A NEW WATER DISTRICT UP AND RUNNING HERE WILL TAKE SIX TO NINE MONTHS, THEY SAY, REPLACING ALL THE OLD PIPES EVEN LONGER.